Hello everyone, welcome to Talented Developer. In this tutorial, we are going to see how to update any existing user. So first of all, we will try to add the new attribute in the existing user. And after that, we will try to update the existing attribute. So if you remember, in whole series, we are using LDAP.js, right? So they have already one method, modify. We are going to use same. So before that, what we have to do, just come and we need to copy our old code and just paste below here because it will be like same we need to update only a little bit so first of all we need to update the name as update user and you can see here we need to pass the chain object either it can be single chain or it can be array of objects so first field operation so this is the add so we are going to add the new attribute so we need to change here add right and in modification like which attribute you are going to add so this will be like display name because I am going to add the new attribute as a display name and here you can put any value like whatever you are going to add so maximum thing I am having the static you can pass dynamic value from this function and after that you can see right this is the full DN of that user so what we have to do just come here and put the dn here because we are going to pass the dn dynamically and come here and we need to change the log message also so i'm just going to put here update user right added update user you can put any message right and after that what we have to do we have to call this function so if you remember whenever we are running our app.js it will call this function here we need to comment that code after that what we have to do just call our function update user here we need to pass the dn so which user we are going to update so you can see right go to the properties and copy full address just come and try to run so once you will run you can see we are getting the message like perfectly added now just come and cross check just press f5 or you can refresh you can see here display name has been added here so this is the way to add but imagine display name attribute is already there now you need to update this three four six value some different so what you can thought like initially maybe you can just come and you same thing and you're going to change something like this one so once you will run on that time you will get an error because here you can see more than one value has been provided because that attribute is already there so if you need to update what you have to do just go to the document if you go down here directly they have said like we have to use the replace so what we have to do just come change here replace right now run go to the here refresh right you can see the new value has been updated so I hope you understand like how to add the new attribute or how to update the existing attribute so in next tutorial we are going to see the compare 